welcome to Loughborough Dynamo. You're the new assistant manager. There'll be a lot of people watching who want to know how you've ended up here. Can you talk to us about how you how you got here? No, uh, it's pretty much obviously I decided to stop playing uh, professionally, uh, and I've known Brad for a long time, and I've had conversations uh, a few times, maybe coming to play and stuff like that. But I'm 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 thinking about making a decision, and I've looking down the coaching managerial route, and. Uh, we just had various conversations over the time and uh, we had a conversation in the last couple of weeks and we just feel like it's the right time for both of us and he needed a bit of help and I also wanted to get on the ladder and start trying to understand that side of football. So I think it works works really well for the both of us. And you come to the club with a lot of experience at a higher level, what for Nottingham Fires and things. How do you think that will help you in your role here? Uh, I think it will always it would always help me because uh, I understand football. I understand kind of how I think football should be played, but it's also a chance to learn. It's a chance to learn about this football and learn about these players, and, and, I'm, and I'm really up for that. So even though my experience of, of playing at uh, the level I've played at will be beneficial towards me, I'm also very, very looking forward and keen to, to learn this level. And you were quite involved on the touchline today. How did you see the game? How do you think it went? Uh, no, I really enjoyed it, really enjoyed it and I think that uh, it was very, uh, probably a bit difficult for me at first because it's the first time that I've seen the players so I just wanted to try and assess them and look from afar as, as much as pop possible and leave kind of things up to Brad, especially this week uh, but once I got on the sideline I, it, was, it, was, it was hard not to get involved and like I said, I think we... We did well in the terms of we got the goals where we needed to get the goals. Uh, I think we can all being in the change rooms and, and listening to the to, to the guys. It's not the best performance. We're not happy with the performance. And I did say to them at half time, just don't let them back in the game. That's the main important. And and we did, and they got a bit of head of steam. And and that's what happens in football at any level. Uh, and listen, I'm just happy that we got the goal. And we got the three points. Cause I think over the course of the game, we deserved the three points. And if we'd have, if we'd have dropped two points, I think we'd have been uh, really good. So, no, I think we're happy all around, but there's, uh, there's a lot of work to be done.